I'm here at the gallery at Hillcrest where we're showing the story of Laverne. We came together, the Historical Society of Laverne, the City of Laverne, University of Laverne, Benita Unified School District, and looked at the large accumulation of stuff. And the more we talked about it, the more we wanted it to be for the children. By the uh, end of today, we will have had 421 children. Third graders, they have a whole unit of study on community, and this fits right in with their curriculum to be in this city and what it means for them because they are the future of Laverne. And it's come together in a beautiful fashion, multicolored and multifaceted. We've looked at it through transportation, through arts and culture, through commerce, the faith community, our family life, and what it means to be a resident of Laverne. Uh, we have uh, culture bearers or docents for each one of the topics. Then they go to uh, our boardroom and have a PowerPoint presentation and some crafts that support the theme of the story of Laverne. And then they go over to our citrus room, decorated with orange crepe and a huge citrus tree. They make their own labels for orange crates and have some oranges. As we share our historical past with our children, research has shown that their resilience to face adversity in their own life increases. So this experience, we hope, is building a stronger generation ahead of us. Not only that, but the residents of Hillcrest, many of whom are represented in these historical pictures, were boys and girls in these schools themselves. Their parents taught in these schools themselves. The story of Laverne, a historical exhibit dedicated to Galen and Doris Erie. Now they're husband and wife. They were longtime residents of Laverne, dedicated their lives to the service of others. Parents, come back. If your kids haven't seen the exhibit, if you haven't seen the exhibit, please come. It's free, open to the public, seven days a week. Anytime during the day, drop in and uh, have a look.